to 24 days of Christmas. Today I am going to be going 0 to 100 with my hair, so I am going to take you through my shower routine, how I wash my hair, all that stuff, to getting it styled and looking glamorous such as this. So I hope you guys enjoy and let's get into it. Alright, so for shampoo and conditioner, what I used in my hair are the Fix Argon Oil Shampoo and I put this in um, and I follow the directions. Basically you just put this in all over your hair and you also want to put it in your roots and a bit on your scalp. I have a really really dry scalp and so much so that sometimes it itches so bad that I start scratching it and it starts bleeding. So that's how dry my um, my scalp actually is. So I looked for an intensive hair mask uh, slash uh, mask for my head so that I wouldn't keep having that issue because every time I would um, basically scratch my head um, it would just start flaking and scabs would start coming out and it was just, it was, it was bad and it would start bleeding. So what I did was I put in the Argan Oil Intensive Hair Mask by Fix. I put this on my scalp, my roots, and then I kind of faded it out into the ends of my hair and I left it in for five minutes and my hair feels so soft. Um, it's kind of amazing. And then after that, I applied the Argon Oil Conditioner, and then I left this in for two minutes, and then I rinsed out my hair. Um, so yeah, uh, I did the whole Shazam today. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to brush my hair. Um, I'm going to be curling my hair today just because I feel like it looks a little more done. Fun fact, I rarely ever brush my hair. If you actually see me out and about, majority of the time my hair will not be brushed. It is just the way it is. Uh, even on Sundays when I go to church, majority of the time my hair is not brushed. Um, just because that is the way my hair does. So, I'm going to do this to my hair a little bit. So, what I'm going to do first is I'm going to add the Royal Spa Awu. I don't even know how to pronounce that, but it's a gel mousse and it is a non-aerosol alcohol free styling mousse and this has um, aloe vera, kiwi, mango, and passion fruit um, to add some volume and it smells really really good. So this is what it looks like. Like how weird is that? It's like literally a gel. It's like a slime and then as you rub your hands together you actually activate it. So um, this is what it looks like and now I'm just going to do this. <laughs> I look a little crazy but this is what gets me the volume and the curl and the style that I use. Alright, next what I'm going to do is I'm going to apply the C, the C Bella um, Soft Hold Styling Cream and I'm just going to apply this to my roots and kind of just like run it through my hair rather than just concentrate it on a certain area. I don't blow dry my hair, I only ever air dry it. Um, the only time I ever blow dry my hair is if I absolutely have to, um, but I rarely ever absolutely have to. So, what I'm gonna do is I am going to go do my makeup, get a couple things done while my hair air dries, and I will catch you guys when my hair is three quarters of the way. Okay, so I am back. Um, I've eaten lunch. It is much later now. I made lunch. I have started dinner. I have done my makeup and I've made myself a cup of tea because as you can probably hear, I am not feeling well at all. Um, I have a stuffy nose and I also have um, kind of this awful sounding cough. So my hair is pretty much dry. Um, it, and as you can see, because I put it in a bun, it's already started to curl a bit, um, which is what I like. I like to put my hair in a bun, especially if I'm going to be sleeping on it. I like to put my hair in a bun and give my hair a little bit of curl, um, and all that stuff. So what I'm going to start doing now is I'm going to style my hair. I'm using this very old and broken, uh, Conair, uh, curling iron. 
Um, it's one of those clampy ones and you can use whatever curling iron you want, but this is just the one that I've chosen for today. Um, you're going to need a comb for parting, um, although I have already parted my hair exactly where I want it. Um, my hair was cooperating today, thank the Lord, so I have to, uh, it's doing everything I need it to do today. I have a couple of other products here as well. I have the Marrakesh, or Marrakesh, I don't know how to pronounce this, Oil Argon and Hemp Oil Therapy. This is a hairstyling elixir. Uh, this right here is the Royal Spa uh, Hold and Shine Spray. Uh, this is their hairspray with uh, root extract chamomile and wild cherry bark extract. And then this right here is the C. Bella uh, Luxury Daily Treatment. This is the Hot Iron Prep Spray. What I'm going to do is I'm going to start off by... Um, I'm going to take off my ring because I don't want to get product all over it. I'm going to take this oil here and I'm going to put a couple of pumps... It smells so good too. It smells like caramel. And I'm just gonna run this through my hair, around my hair, mostly on the ends, not too much um, up here, but I do wanna run this on the end. Next, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to spray a little bit of this hairspray from far away. This is basically just going to hold the hair in place. This is just going to hold the hair in place and what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to take a comb and comb through it just so that the hairspray doesn't get stuck um, in certain places of the hair so it doesn't make it look crunchy or anything like that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this spray now and I'm just going to spray my hair with it. I've got a couple of rubber bands here and so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take about half of my hair and I'm just going to very sloppily just put it up in kind of that. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take a section here, I'm going to take my curling iron here and I'm just going to start at the, at the top. I'm going to curl it inwards like so, leaving a bit of hair out. And then I'm going to whew, curl it back in. I'm going to hold it there for a few seconds, wait for the hair to warm up, wait for it to really heat up here, and then I will release it. Like so. And what you want to do is you really want this curl to hold. You want... You don't want to brush it out just yet um, because that will kind of, you want the hair to actually cool in that position. I apologize if I seem very, very slow at this. And let me be honest with you, I don't actually curl my hair all that often. Um, I only really ever curl it maybe once or twice a month, twice a month at most. Majority of the time, I just put some mousse in my hair, let it air dry, and it's just big and voluminous the way I want it. Um, and then over time, I can, you know, dampen it, put it in braids, and it just gives me the curl that I want. So I'm very lucky that I have hair like that. That just allows me to do whatever the heck I want with it. Um, my hair is very, very easy to style. Um, even my hairdresser, she loves styling my hair because it's super easy for her to just style. So this is what it looks like so far, just really curled, pretty tight, especially on this side. I like the way this side looks better, um, to be honest with you, but uh, yeah. So now what I'm going to do is I am going to take my other rubber band and tie this back into a very loose ponytail.
Alright, so this is the state of my hair so far. I'm going to take out the back. I like the way that this is sitting, the way that this is lying here. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to comb through. I'm going to hit it with a little extra hairspray on the sides here. I'm going to take my comb. Just kind of this. This is how my hair looks and I am super duper happy with the way it turned out. So the way I curl the top layer is I curl it uh, towards my face but then on the outside I start to clamp it open and I fold it over so that it goes away from my face and I just find that that gives you this kind of nice voluminous kind of looking bang. Um, and it kind of gives you this illusion that you have a bang, but you don't. And so I really, really like the way that this looks. Who knows, maybe one day I'll look back at this video and be like, what were you doing? You look stupid. Um, however, I like it. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. I will do more hair stuff, uh, in 2018. Um, I've thought about it and I'm like, you know what? I really do enjoy doing my hair and whenever people ask me, how I do my hair when I actually do my hair. Um, usually I'm just like, you know what, I should just do a tutorial about it. So I think that's what I'm going to start doing. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love you guys and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.